I grew up at Gregory, Arkansas. Uh, went to school here through the third grade. And then we moved to Augusta, and we always had horses in our lives and cattle. And, and matter of fact, we rode horses to school from time to time. And uh, so I've had a, a love for uh, horses and uh, dogs and all animals. Uh, I got bird dogs, and I got Franklin, who's my sidekick. And so. Uh, but we got away from the horses and moved to Little Rock, and I've been in the restaurant business for 43 years. And I intended to get a real job, but I, uh, I, I waited too late. I, <laughs> too old now, uh, so I'll just stay where I am. When we bought this place several years ago and, and uh, got it up and going again, well, I bought uh, some horses. Uh, hadn't had them in years, and I bought some horses. And I started breeding them, and uh, I've been a, I think I, the American Quarter Horse people sent me a 15 year breeding certificate uh, the other day. I got a trainer, and uh, we started buying uh, better horses, better bred horses, and uh, showing some. I, I didn't show. Uh, a horse show is like watching paint dry to me, but. My, my trainer was an excellent guy, Tim uh, Laws, and he, uh, he, he was a, a great trainer and a great guy. And uh, we, we just kept on stepping up and better horses and, uh, uh, you know, and, and breeding. Uh, Tim and I sold, bought and sold a lot of horses, and uh, I ended up with 12 broodmares. We bred them all every year to top stadiums. The, the two yearlings I have now uh, are uh, cutting horse bred. They they will go uh, to uh, they're they're uh, they're paid up in the uh, super stakes and uh, the money, and so we're uh, we're uh, they're cutting horses, and uh, they'll go into they'll go into training. They they'll the the yearlings will be broke to ride in, in the next few months after, well, after the first of the year. And then they will start training as hut, cutting horses. You know, they're, they're like pets to me. I, I, uh, I, you know, I lay my hand on them and uh, I enjoy feeding them. Uh, it, it's not a chore. I, I love to look at them. I love to be with them. And, uh, and you need to. I mean, there's a lot of things can happen, and you need to know it if they've got a problem. So uh, I, I cherish my time feeding and, and association with my animals.